and hello everyone sports cards Austin here we are here today to give you guys uh, some fun hopefully and uh, we're gonna be opening the 2020 score jumbo packs 40 cards per pack Tom Brady picture in the front Joe Burrows possible did open a couple of these a few weeks ago I've now got my hands on four of them so we're gonna go through these four see what we can we can uh, score here. Got everything ready to roll for you guys. Um, also have a 2015-16 Upper Deck SPX uh, Hobby Box coming. We'll get that in a few days, rip it open, see what we get. Uh, several autographs. I think it's four autograph or patch cards per box. We're looking for the Connor McDavid card uh, out of there. Uh, tr either patch or patch auto or auto or any Connor McDavid will work for me. Um, so, uh, got coffee here, ready to go, Longhorns here, we're going to get going for you guys, and we're going to hopefully get uh, some burrows or an autograph or something uh, out of these packs. So here we go, first pack, 2020 score, Tom Brady pictured, maybe we'll pull him out, who knows, let's go ahead and get her ripped open. So we can see what we, what we pull. I did today receive a few things for you guys before we get started. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get a few of these graded here. Uh, first one is the foil 1993 SP Upper Deck or HSSP foil Chipper Jones card sold last for um, over two thousand dollars in the PSA 10. This will go to SGC. It looks pretty good. I think there's a little nick on the corner up on the left, but we'll see. Overall, the centering looks good. I'm thinking it's you know at least a nine, maybe eight and a half. We'll see. Could get a ten. Who knows? And this one looks really nice. Horace Grant on the rise. Over two hundred in a PSA 10. There's Jordan, right here. J O R. I think that's why his card is going up. Also, it's his rookie, 86 Fleer. And, uh, actually, it's 88 Fleer, sorry. 88 Fleer, Horace Grant rookie. I did uh, get this today. That's going to go get graded at SGC. Uh, what else do we have here? I have several of the Bo Jackson 93 SPs coming. Uh, anybody's interested on those? Uh, those will all get graded. I'm going to list them. I'm hoping for some tens. It's a ten and uh, from SGC, a uh, mass PSA ten sold for over three hundred dollars. Um, so I'm hoping to get that ready and graded for you guys. Also, just another mention: still running. About six hours or so left in the bidding. I think um, sports cards Austin on eBay. We have the eight and a half Jordan Fleer sticker and my uh, the Tom Brady seven and a half SGC press pass 2000 both of those cards have about six hours left in the bidding and uh, right now I'm going pretty good we'll see how they go also gonna have some other cards going uh, to get graded soon have quite a bit Chad John or I mean uh, AJ Green uh, rookie 2011 Chrome uh, a few Kobe Bryant's, uh, a few Scotty Pippins going. Um, let's see. Got a few autographs going uh, up right now. I do have a few other cards. Not one of the big three, but it is a hot card right now. Luis Robert, graded 10, GMA 10. That is up for sale right now. If anybody is interested in that. Sports cards also on eBay, eight and a half Clefable first edition or uh, not first edition. It's the um, second edition Hollow um, from 2000 base set that is listed as well. And uh, we have a 1989 Fleer Billy Ripken uh, black box listed nine that is for sale also. Again, those are GMA grading. Anybody likes them? Uh, they're pretty good. I mean, I. Got to do something with them, but I have uh, just begun going to SGC for things uh, just because 
We're going to have a few more graded cards going out soon. Chipper Jones, rookie. Headed now, Honoris. Derek Jeter, platinum. Bowman, platinum. Um, 2010. Uh, the Jordan Hoops. Got a few of those. Those will go get graded. All of these will be heading to SGC soon. I'm waiting for about 70, 75 cards to come back any day now. Hopefully they'll ship them soon. We'll get those listed for you guys, see where we stand. Uh, other than that, so let's get going. Let's see what we get from the point point four pack. Hopefully we pull an auto out of here or, or a uh, game used or uh, you know, who knows. We'll see. A bunch of rookies. We're looking. First pack. Let's go ahead and put these over here. First pack, we have... Curtis Hernan the fourth. Um, Curtis, that's okay. Darius Leonard from the Colts. Mark Ingram. Good card coming up. Mark Ingram the third or second rather from Baltimore. Decent card. Here is a. I guess you can consider this a rookie. I don't know. We'll see. Gardner Minshew. We're going to go ahead and sleeve him up. I think I'm going to go ahead and get this one graded. I did send uh, the last few guys were watching the last videos that one well, few of the last videos I've done. Did send a couple of Patrick Mahomes scorecards to get graded. Um, pulled a deep dive and a base Mahomes. Um, went ahead and sent those over to be to be graded. There's the Minshew. We've got uh, Brandon Carr, Patrick, or Yannick Ngagui, Gagui, decent player here, Joe Mixon, a lot of injuries for Joe, good player, and he's healthy, he just Enter too much. And everybody's favorite, Matt Stafford. Still hasn't taken the Lions, Lions to the playoffs. Don't know that he ever will. Tajay Sharp. Decent player. Decent player here, Marvin Jones Jr., former Falcon. Now a backup, I guess, Marcus Mariota. And we're going to go ahead and get this card out. Even though it's not a rookie, we'll still get it. Anything Khalil Mack is worth a shot. We're going to go ahead and sleeve him up. It is a Khalil Mack. Not his rookie card. It's probably worth 50 cents, but to the right person, graded. Nine or ten might might bring in you know twelve or fifteen bucks possibly we'll see um, decent card here actually really really good decent good player gonna be a good player anyway Drew Locke University of Missouri Broncos rookie card it looks like first year card I don't know it's actually his rookie card I have seen some pretty cool Drew Locke uh, redemptions pulled. Um, Tevin Coleman. The end. Here we go. Pretty good. McCaffrey. Again, you know whether or not I send some of these in. The, the some of these guys, I am gonna just go ahead and put in card saver ones and uh, penny sleeves, just because. Whether or not they get graded or not, I don't know. We will see. Todd Gurdon the second. I don't know if Gurdon's really worth going to a sleeve, but really eventually the way I see it is I'm going to get all my cards eventually graded. It's going to take a long time to do, but I, I think that the honest and best way to do the card is to get them graded. More bang for your buck. Yes, I'll probably lose money on several, but uh, at the end of the day, I don't have to deal with Matt Ryan here. Uh, I don't have to do with people wondering what the condition of the card is and uh, you know they're gonna know that they're getting a good product. Um, 
and uh, you know they'll know the condition of the car and that's the main thing for me um, I've tried selling a few raw cards but I just can't figure out the shipping and I know a lot of people don't and do or don't like it but I don't like to ship through PWE plain white envelope I, I just I don't like getting in the items in the mail and PWE and I don't like shipping PWE I just did I just don't so it's just my preference another player here decent Kenyon Drake pretty good player actually Irv Smith Jr. Vikings game that's pretty good rookie card looks like so we're gonna be getting some Irv going here No big hits yet. Cooper Cup. Red parallel. The next the Cooper Cup and the next card are the biggest hits of the pack so far. Kind of a slow start to the pack until this. This is starting to look better. Cooper Cup red parallel and a oh well. Three in a row. Jamal Williams red parallel. That's a good one. And Jamal Williams fans, I did see him play for BYU against the Longhorns here. Man, that team had Jamal and they had, uh, can't think of his name, I'm drawing a blank, but, the, but um, God, BYU, uh, uh, BYU, the quarterback, I can't think of his name right now. Hold on a minute. I'll tell you. Jamal Williams, um, card. But man, that team really, really tore apart rookie card here of uh, Jake Brigham. Taysom Hill, that's who it is. Taysom Hill. Sorry, I, I drew a blank. Him and Jamal Williams put on a show. You talk about speed, folks. Taysom Hill may be the fastest player I've ever seen. I thought Vince Young was fast, but Taysom Hill I think is a little faster than, than Vince and, uh, and his prime. And uh, Man, what a player. What a special player. I know Taysom Hills. Uh, he's just a special player to me. He's a good player. Pretty pretty cool stuff. Man, the pack is starting to heat up here. We've got a score 3D Panthers. Put that over here. And a, well, here we go. It is heating up. Here we I just sent this in to get graded. Now we're, we've gotten several more in the, in the zone. Christian McCaffrey. All right, the pack. This is a good pack. Good pack. Any three red parallels. Got our first Mahomes, and we've got two Christian McCaffrey's. Let's say that's pretty good for the day. I could stop now and be happy with this. This is a deep dive Patrick Mahomes, and um, I have gone ahead. One of these is waiting. It's at SGC. SGC is currently six to eight weeks out, so they've had the card for about a week or two now. So. I don't know, the end of August, 30 September, we will uh, come back to you guys with uh, to show you the cards when they come in, as they come in. And uh, we'll review some of the grades and see what we're doing. Harrison Smith from the Vikings. Good card. Looks like we got another red parallel. Wow, this is something. And that one's dead. <laughs> good. Here's Michael Thomas game face. Every time I make these videos, you guys ever watch, I either run out of the card server one or the penny sleeves. This time it looks like it's going to be the penny sleeves. So I will have to open a new pack probably here, but for now we're not going to do that. Here's a good card here. Dalvin Cook in the zone. Like I say, if he stays healthy, I think Minnesota's on to something. It's going to come down to the quarterback play. It's going to come down to Dalvin Cook, and it's going to come down to the defense. And typically, they have a decent defense, so we'll see. I mean, they—I don't know. We'll see. We have a Seattle Seahawks hold up a Russell Wilson picture. Decent card there. I'll put these next levels here. Well. Yeah, I'll just put them there slightly over a little bit further. There we go. 
Kenny Galloway on the Lions. Pretty decent player. Here we go. Deshaun Watson game face. It's a nice card. So is the next one. Another in the zone. That one is Amari Cooper. Cooper said he wanted to play for the Cowboys so much he took a pay cut. We'll see if it pays off. He's on Cooper. Hopefully we can get through this pack without uh, me having to open up a new card saver or a new penny sleeve pack. Baltimore Ravens, Earl Thomas III, Marcus Peters, Marlon Humphrey, 3D, score 3D card, decent. Bubba, or Buddha Baker, Cardinals, next level, red parallel, decent card, and we did not make it, so I'm going to just give me one second, and we're going to crack open another pack, got them right here, of the Ultra Pro 100, 100 sleeves. In here, and I'll just take them all out. When I got through these. I think I've got some more card saver ones in the way as well. I go through those things like crazy. One thing, one thing I wish would happen is I wish that the, I wish that the grading companies, and I don't know if you got to ask them specifically, but I wish they would they would send back the card saver ones. They, they, I, I bet that place is overrun with people. Sending in card saver ones and twos and whatnot, threes, fours, whatever, fives, if anybody's doing that. And uh, here's a Jawan Johnson rookie from Oregon. But man, can you imagine if they actually sent the card saver ones back to you? Wow, that'd be awesome. Then you wouldn't have to buy them. I mean, you can get them back. I wonder if I said, hey, can you send these back for just charge me a $20 fee to send them back at least, you know, so I can get them back, but I don't know, maybe you can do that. Anyway, here's a good card. I think he's going to be a good player. Thaddeus Moss, LSU Tiger. Randy Moss's son. Here's a Tyler Johnson rookie. And again, most of these rookies, you know, you, you never, you won't know if they're going to be any good until... Even after the rookie year, you won't know really until any of these. I mean, you, we know all the stars, rookie players. You know the the, the um, you know Joe Burrows of the world. We know those guys are going to be great, right? I mean, every now and then they're a bust, but but the, it's the other rookies that you don't know. You know, somebody steps in, has a great game, couple of games, plays two or three years, and then they become a star. You know. Tyler Johnson, Minnesota. They got a good program down there in Minnesota now. Here, there's a here's one, folks, coming up. Noah Igbenogoni. Good card coming up here. Finally, Dallas Cowboys. Is it the Dallas Cowboys? Did they take him? I think so. I'm having a rough day today, remembering. I, I don't know where I'm at today. But got a rookie card from Auburn. But C.D. Lamb, I do know him. Good card. And then Zach Moss is our last card. Pretty cool card there. CD Man. Liking it. Really, really good. This was a good first pack. It really was. It was a good first pack. We've already got Mahomes. Got a CD Lamb. A few rookies. We got two Christian McCaffreys. Not bad, folks. Not bad. No autograph. No patch. Nothing like that. But these were good cards. Zach Moss, Utah. Utah is another team's tough. All right. Pack two. Pack two. This is my about my fourth pack of these I've opened. I've yet to pull Joe Burrow. So here we go. Juju Smith Schuster.
Kevin Balage, Dolphins, Carlos Hyde, Texans, Stephon Gilmore, Patriots, Marlon Mack, Colts. Going through these kind of fast because I, I don't want the video to be an hour and a half long. Marlon Mack. Marquise Brown. Looks like a rookie. Good card there. Marquise Brown, pretty good player. A lot of players opting out for the 2020 NFL season. I, I, I understand why. Um, see what happens this year. DJ Chart Jr. Good card coming up next if he stays healthy. Carson Wentz. This Carson Wentz looks a little off center. Maybe it's just me. Wentz. Kendall Fuller. Dexter Lawrence. Joey Bosa. What a surprise that is. Good card. Joey Bosa. Again, this is all the card saver ones that I have until my, I ordered 400 more. So we'll see when they show up. Should show up any day now. We should be okay. There's about 150 in here. <laughs> Here's a receiver, Golden Tate, the third. Pretty good player, actually. He just been on bad teams. Derek Carr. And if I wonder, let me go back to that Todd Gurley. I wonder if that is a different, is that the same Todd Gurley that we pulled earlier? It is, okay. I just wanted to make sure. Different variation, I couldn't remember. I didn't. Another Matt Ryan, him sliding. Look at, let's see here, Matt. Matt Ryan, we did okay. There you are. Trying to sort of keep the cards in some kind of order so I can have the same ones together. Another Kenyon Drake. Man, this happened to me before. If you guys watched my other video, uh, the one I made two videos ago with the uh, 1990 91 Fleer uh, box that I opened basketball. Every single pack in that box almost was the same exact cards, same exact packs, over and over again. Again, Kenyon Drake, we've already seen him once. Irv Smith Jr. And again, this is this looks. I mean, this is. It looks like it's going to change here, but it was, for a few minutes, this was the same exact pack that we already had. Um, that's kind of interesting. Here is a Devin White. Oh, and look at that. Coming up next. I'm trying to put all the rookies in the sleeves. I know I shouldn't. Like I said, sometimes, you know, you get four or five, ten of the same rookie cards. And a lot of times those cards, look at uh, Robert, Luis Roberts. If he, you know, cards soar in value. You know, when they're in, when they're in card saver ones, I don't have to hunt for them. But here's a good card. Aaron Rodgers. Aaron Rodgers, future Hall of Famer. They're out there watching. Danica Patrick is no longer with Aaron Rodgers. Apparently, he dumped her, I heard. So, any Danica Patrick fans out there, time to see what she's up to, I guess. Ooh, not a couple of nice uh, red parallels. First one's cool. Young Ho Koo, and the next one is a very nice red parallel, Jared Goff. I'm going to go out on the limb here and say that out of the packs I've opened, the Jared Goff is probably the best parallel that I've seen so far. For me, I'm happy with that. It works. Very, very cool. Jared Goff, pack fresh. Pack fresh, and that's a good uh, thing that it's pack fresh. Did we get another Patrick Mahomes coming up here? Boy, these packs are loaded with Patrick Mahomes. 
JJ Terrell, we did. JJ, sorry folks, AJ Terrell. Score parallel rookie from Clemson. Might be a pretty good card at some point. And wow, I just, another Patrick Mahomes. I'll take Patrick Mahomes all day. He, his cards are exploding in value. And I know it's not his rookie card. It's not worth thousands, but you know, get have a grade on there, and all of a sudden that you know, one dollar Patrick Mahomes. If it gets a ten, SGC or PSA or or BGS becomes you know fifteen or twenty bucks. So why not do? Why not? Here is a Mark Andrews next level. I have been doing cards for a long time, so. Deep dive, Keenan Allen. Put that right here. Actually, we're gonna put it here. Uh, let's, don't, let's put that over here. Buddha, Buddha Baker, not the red parallel, just a regular next level card. I'm gonna look up some pricing on these cards. I don't like how much pricing others. Aaron Donald. Let's, let's leave this. One of the few 99 rated players on Madden. Anybody is interested in that? I don't really play Madden. Uh, I play him. I'll be the show, but not Madden. I'm not a big Madden guy. Just no good at it. Played the. I have. I had every Madden from the year it came out. I think it was '98 until about 2010. I just gave up on it after that. It got too complicated, and I'm not a very good video game player anyway. So. MLB The Show is more my speed. I have every MLB The Show they've ever made, except for 19 and 20. My well, lace is 18. I'll probably buy 19 here later on and get 20 eventually. See, Kelly in the zone. And, and again, I, I know, 18. I'm trying to finish all the missions first before I move on. So, another Joey Bosa and Melvin Gordon. 3D, score 3D. We're into the part of the pack now that's going to start giving us rookies and in the zone. It's those first. If you can get, if you can survive the first eight or ten cards in these forty card packs, they'll do, you'll get some good players. You will get some good players. It's just a matter of surviving. You know, can you get a Tom Brady out of the first eight or ten cards or something? You know, really good card here. Saquon Barkley. Now we did go to Dalvin Cook in the zone earlier. We pulled a Z a few minutes ago here. Two cards ago. Deep dive. Looks like DJ Shark Jr. And with the King Allen. We pulled Jamal Adams. That's a good card. I think he just got traded. King or is he? See how that goes. Next up, we have the Quan Delvin Cook again. Game face. Wow, we're getting quite a few cooks. The third one already. Uh, two packs. Two more packs to go after this one, folks. I'm trying to get through these fast for you. I want. I know this. I don't. You know, people don't uh, watch the whole video. They just check in from time to time. Sean Watson in the zone. That's probably pretty good. Uh, again, I'll have to check. I mean, I'm sure these are pretty common cards. I'm sure that, you know, Deshaun is probably, I bet I can probably go on eBay and find the, a hundred of them for two, two to four bucks or five bucks or whatever. Somebody's probably got them listed. We are in the actual, the, the, the uh, rookie part of the pack. First rookie up is still searching for Joe Burrow. Got a Tua last time. Still searching, and we also pulled a Calvin Johnson rookie from the Longhorn. Uh, anyway. You guys are probably not hanging with me. Let's see. Uh, Kendrick Rogers. Aggies. First rookie of the pack. Next rookie of the pack is pretty good player. Patrick Taylor, Jr. 
think this had a decent team last year. I've been wondering if they're even going to play football this year. A lot of Mac has canceled their season, moved it to, to the spring, which I, you know, if these play, if these guys and these people really thought about it, that's really what needs to be done. James Morgan, because, you know, if they're talking about all this coming back in the, in the, in the fall, why not wait till the spring when the weather gets nicer? And when these guys can play and not, you know, possibly have fans by then, you know, a lot of these places, a lot more fans anyway. Jamal Morgan, Longhorns, there. Oh, Devin Duvernay. I am keeping that card, folks. Curtis Weaver. I am keeping Devin Duvernay. I am not getting rid of Devin Duvernay unless I pull a second one. I will send the Devin Duvernay to SGC to get graded, though. And again, I've said this over and over again, I like SGC over PSA and BGS. I just, their customer service is better, their cases are better, and I just like, uh, for me, it works. PSA, I just can't, they're, they're, I've had so many PSA cases break on me. It's unbelievable. And BGS makes a heavy case, or a lot heavier. Devin Duvernay, wow. That's a cool card. Good player. He's he, I'm telling you right now, keep your eye on this guy, Devin Duvernay. His cards are going to go up in value pretty quick, I would say. He's, he's going to be worth a lot uh, if you can pull his autograph or whatever. A parallel card or whatever of Devin Duvernay. I'm going to stock up on Devin Duvernay cards for future. Last card of the pack, Missouri Tigers. Albert Oakwood Boonum. I had a Oakwood Boonum. Sorry, I butchered that so much. That was the last part of the pack. Pack three. Pack three. Still no Joe Burrow. I could probably buy a box of these if I did Joe, Joe Burrow, but that's okay. Here we go. Miles Boykin. Chris Conley. Pretty decent running back here. Gus Edwards. I mean, he's had a few good games for the Ravens. No Tom Brady either yet. Jamie Collins, good player. Uh, David Njoku, <laughs> I think he's trying to force his way out of Cleveland right now, and I don't know why. He's not that great of a player. He's good in college. Trade Tredavious White. Patriots. Jarrell Peppers. Very decent player. Josh Jacobs. Player Darius Slayton, Ooh. good card. Darius Slayton, pretty good player. Sleep him up. Miles Jack is next. <clears throat> Miles Jack, good player. Bradley Chubb, a pretty decent player. Ooh, here's a guy I think is going to be pretty good. Well, look who's coming up. Dwayne Haskins, good card. Dwayne, he's going to be a decent. I'm telling you, people may not think so, but but uh, Dwayne Haskins is going to be a really good quarterback. I think he's going to surprise people. And look, look who it is again. Wow. Another one. Patrick Mahomes. That's going to get graded. This is our third Mahomes. Three packs, three Mahomes. Hey, we're, we're running on, on uh, three for three here. Darnell Savage. I think this guy made a cut. I 
can't remember. I think he had a couple of one or two big games for the Packers. Uh, okay. Mike Evans, good player. Gerard Davis, decent. Tom Brady, he's going to have some major weapons in Tampa. I think he's got going to have, he, he may. Tom Brady may have one of the best seasons of his career coming up. He's 43, 42, 43. I'm two years older than him. Uh, my birthday was last on the 5th of August. If anybody's out there wants to say happy birthday, Mike Evans. But I think Tom Brady now has weapons, and I think Tom Brady is going to be. You're, you're going to look at a career. He, just the receiver, the talent is there. We'll see. Cam Jordan, good player. Another Tevin Coleman. And our second or third, I believe it's our third, Christian McCaffrey. We've got two base cards in parallel. Or a, I had a deep dive. I can't, I can't remember. I'll have to go back and look. Anybody's watching the PGA right now, I've got it up. I'm just not uh, watching it because I'm doing this video. We'll have to check it out. We'll see if Tung Lee can hold on. Ooh, nice parallel coming up here. Damian Williams dropped it out of the season, but uh, still not a bad parallel. But um, Adrian Peterson, Hall of Famer. Pretty cool. I like Peterson. He's a good player. This guy, you know, I'm telling you right now, folks, Adrian Peterson. Oh, my goodness. Good player. I bet AP could still outrun half, half the people in the league, even though he's had several injuries now. I bet he could still outrun people, and I bet he could still rush for 1,000 yards if Washington gave him the chance to. Good. Here we go right here, folks. This could overtake the... This could overtake the Jared Goff as the best parallel card. Red parallel. I've gotten Henry Ruggs the third rookie card. This one might be worth. This one might be worth five ten bucks right now. I have no idea. Henry Ruggs the third. That is a really good card. We've got a game face Joe Mixon. In the zone Joey Bosa. Our third Joey Wilson. Huddle with the Dallas Cowboys. Again, that's my team. I'm not going to sleeve it up, though. I don't think. Maybe I will. Cam Jordan, next level. Pretty decent next level cards. 3D card, Cam Hayward, Minka Fitzpatrick, TJ Watt, JJ Watt's brother. Steelers fans out there. In the zone, Russell Wilson followed by a good one. Second Khalil Mack of the day. In the zone, Khalil Mack coming up. Pretty cool Russell Wilson. I guess I can put it straight in. Pretty cool Khalil Mack. And then we have another huddle up. Dallas Keller, uh, Green Bay Packers. Pretty cool card. I have no idea what these huddled ups will be worth here right now, but 10 years from now, who knows? Go Matt, good card. Huddle. Packers. Bobby Wagner, next level. Cool card. Look at this. Did we get a Jimmy G? We did get a Jimmy G. Oh, yes. Jimmy G, Jimmy Garoppolo, in game face. And look at the next card, Lamar Jackson in the zone, our first Lamar. I think that's the first Lamar I pulled. And it's, and it's in the end zone, which might be worth five or ten bucks. I like these packs. I think we got a game face red parallel coming up, and we do. Let's find out who that is. This pack is becoming pretty hot here. And we got somebody coming up. I don't know. We'll see. Lamar Jackson. That's a good card. I'll have to look at it again. Who knows? They're, they're probably. Oh, yes, folks. We did it. Second one. Second one I pulled. Next card. First, let's focus on the end of the Dalvin Cook. 
giving us a game face parallel, red parallel. Wow, that's our fourth Dalvin. This is a good card. Dalvin Cook, that's a nice card. And there he is. We've done it. Second time, second one, Tua. Talk about Tag O Viola. Second Tua. Well, I guess if I'm not going to pull Joe Burrow out, I might as well pull the next best thing, Tua. Second one. I think I sent the other one to SGC already. We'll see. Raekwon Davis. How about Raekwon? So it looks like we have one pack to pull Joe Burrow. And also from Ohio State, we haven't pulled uh, Nick Bosa yet. Well, wow. Raekwon Davis, it's a good card. Isaiah Hodgins, Harrison Bryant from FAU. Florida Atlantic getting in on the action. Uh, Oregon State getting in on the action. Boy, when Mike Riley was there, they were well coached, good football teams. You now they just kind of faded away. Mike Riley is a good coach. He'll turn Nebraska around. Don't know how long it's going to take. I, I really don't even know if Nebraska is ever going to be good at football again. I mean, they'll have a bowl, you know, they'll, they'll win eight or ten games, it's like Texas. They'll win eight or ten games, but are they going to be able to win the championship again? You know, I don't know. Harrison Bryant. Jacob Eason, there we go. There's a pretty good player coming up. Darrington Evans. This looks like Appalachian State. How about Appalachian State getting a running back out? They have a good team. Tell you, North Carolina, Appalachian State, looks like a pretty cool campus to go check out, go watch a football game. That's be a pretty fun team to watch at home. They're pretty good. This is a really good card too. He's going to be a pretty good player right here, I believe. Jacob Eason. 3, 23 touchdowns, 8 picks. Pretty good player for the Huskies. So we got the Mahomes, we got the Tua, pulled the Jacob Beeson, pretty good. We're still searching for, for uh, Boa, Bosa, I mean, Burrow. One pack left. Harris Campbell, C.J. Mosley, pretty good player. Here's Minka Fitzpatrick. Minka, oh, and looky here, we did it. Last pack. Minka Fitzpatrick, Tom Brady, there he is, folks. That's a cool looking shot of Tom. Is he actually running the football in this? With like four rushing yards on the year, and that's one of them. I think he passed a thousand rushing yards for his career last year. Here before they made a big deal out of that. I remember Ryan Finley started a few games for the uh, Bengals last year. Of course, the Big Red is now with Dallas. Tom Brady, wow, good card there. Ryan Finley, yet to be seen if he's going to be a decent player or not. Next card's pretty good too from the Houston Cougars. Ed Oliver, when he wants to play, he's a good player. When he chooses to just kind of do his own thing, he has issues. But nonetheless, it's Ed Oliver, still a good card. That's a rookie card, right? Yeah. I didn't say you know, rookie card on there. It's actually, I'm sure he has a 2019 score out there somewhere. It's, it just has his rookie card stats. I think this was actually their first year card. Chris Jones, Kansas City. Good card next. Back to back running backs coming up. A pair of good ones. Zeke Elliott. Zeke Elliott. 
Melvin Gordon the third, decent running back. Tried to hold out. I don't know. Decent player. The holdouts ever really work. Sometimes they do. Sometimes they don't. I hate when a player holds out. I think they're just missing out and giving them more of a chance to get injured when they come back. Gordon. Quite a few cards here. I've used quite a few of the. Blake Jarwin, another cowboy. JJ Arcega Whiteside. Another rookie, I'll keep him in that stack. Philip Lindsay, good card. Good player. Gerard Davis. Have the Lions really ever had a good running back since Barry Sanders? Again, getting the same, sort of the same pack again. Another Christian McCaffrey. Tevin Coleman. Send me the same pack. Great. We'll take the uh, we'll take the Christian McCaffrey and the Todd Gurley you're gonna give us. Third one. Like I say, we did pull Tom Brady out. Good card. We've now got another Todd Gurley, third one. Another Matt Ryan. And then I think the pack will start to change as we get to the parallels. Still no autograph. Still no game use. Still no Joe Burrow. Well, somebody's coming up. I think it's a Tom Brady. It could be. A, that'd be cool. Looks like it could. It's a Patriot. Hopefully it's one of the good ones here. We've got a red parallel coming. We've got a Kenyon Drake. Holy cow. It is Tom Brady. Wow. Red parallel at that. That's a nice card. It, wow. No Brady's and then boom. Back to back. Wow. Impressive. Impressive stuff. Two ton. Sound the horn. Tom Brady, that, that thing might be worth 10 bucks. Ryan Finley, parallel. And I hope my card savers get here soon, because if not, I'm going to have a lot of cards I'm not going to be able to put in the card savers. I'm hoping they're here just tomorrow or the next day. Ryan Finley. Who do we have here? Sean McKeon, red parallel. Sean. That's a pretty good card, Michigan. Wow. I can't believe we Tom Brady Red Parallel. How about that? No Tom Brady's for two packs. Back to back packs with Brady. One of them a red parallel. Four Patrick Mahomes. Three Patrick Mahomes. Good card of McCain. Still looking for Joe Burrow. Drew Brees in the zone. Wow. Drew Brees. Guess I had somebody peek in a minute ago and left. I'm talking to myself most of these videos. You have one person jump in and jump out. Never have really paid attention. I'm too busy opening the cards of how many people are actually viewing this or do view it or whatever. We'll see if there's Drew Brees in the zone. Good card. Jarrell Casey, Kevin Dyard, and Logan Ryan. 3D card. Pretty cool. In the zone, DeAndre Hopkins. Really cool card there. Hopkins with the Cardinals now. Nice card coming up. Deep dive with Lamar Jackson. I don't even think it doesn't look like anyone's watching the video right now. If there is, I, again, I, you know, see the views, see if we're watching or not. We'll see. AJ Brown. Five Lamar, that'll get great. That'll grade well, probably. AJ Brown, another Joe Mixon game face. Waiting for the rookies. So let's see what we get. We're almost there. We got about three, four cards before we'll get to the rookies. Nice AJ Brown card. Good player. Joe Mixon. Pull him earlier. Game face. Some Dallas players. 
Marcus Lawrence, Sharon Smith, Leighton Vanderesh. Vanderesh making an appearance. Good player. Derek Kent. Oh, folks. Wow. Really? Tom Brady again? That was nice. Game face Tom Brady this time. Derrick Henry signed an extension. That's a nice card in his own. Third Tom Brady. Second one in this pack. Wow, that's impressive. I'm liking it. And there's Austin Eckler coming up next. Pretty decent player. Can't pick out many of these. Up. Pick one of these boxes and put them in there. Deep dive Alwyn Kamara. Austin Eckler, nice card. Nice card here. Nice card here. Deep dive Alvin Kamara. There. If I were to say. There's some really nice cards in this in this um, 2020 score set. I just we're searching for the Joe Burrow. I could love to get one. I don't know. Shockwell Barrett. Pair red parallel next level. Decent card. And now we're at the rookies. So, if we're getting in Joe Burrow, it's going to be in the next four to five cards, or we're not going to get one in this box, in this pack. Guess I'm going to have to buy a hobby box to pull Burrow. Derek Brown. And I'm going to run out of these before my hockey box gets here, and I'm going to have to wait to open it for you guys. Donovan Peoples-Jones. Did pull a Tua. I'm kind of disappointed we didn't pull a Joe, a Joe Burrow, but uh, I think that could come later. Cheyenne O'Grady. Arkansas. We've got about two cards left and we will be done. And uh, did we get a Burrow, Joe Burrow or not? I don't think so because nope, we did not pull a Burrow. AJ Dillon. BC Eagles. Boston College. Did pull a Devin, Devin DuVernay card. Anthony Gordon looks like Washington State. Cougars. And we barely had enough cards. Saber ones. We're going to be running low. Gordon. Anthony. Last card. AJ Hamler, Penn State wide receiver. AJ. Alright, for those of you that are watching, if there's anyone watching, I don't think there is right now, but if there is, thanks for hanging around and hanging out with us here. And uh, for those of you that watch this later on, enjoy. Have a great day. Sports Cards Austin Facebook. Sports Cards Austin on eBay. Check our store out. At SportsJP on Twitter. And that's going to do it. Until next time, stay safe out there, everybody. Happy ripping. Uh, hope everybody is able to pull their Joe Burrow or whatever card they're trying to pull out of the packs. And uh, everyone, uh, have a good evening, and we'll talk to you next time.